yeah, we had a dog, um, Sandy. And then after that, we got a dog named Sugar. Um, I'm pretty sure. I wonder if my siblings would remember better. But anyways, um, when we moved to Fountain Green, we also got ducks and chickens and had a horse in our yard because it was the landlord's horse, um, <laughs> which actually ended up Shinaway. It was a it was a mean horse too. It, she reached her hand up. She was two years old, and the horse bit her hand and lifted her up in the air, and she was hanging there like a rag doll, sc just screaming. And her hand was she was lucky because when she went to the doctor, it would have broken all of the bones in her in her hand, but it didn't because her hand wasn't developed yet, so it was all cartilage still. And the teeth bit between the they, cartilage. Yeah, and so it was so, she was so lucky that nothing was broken, and it just basically was swollen for a little while, and then it went down. So lucky. But, but that's not the story you were going to um, tell. No. <laughs> <laughs> but I was like, well, let me catch up to where, you, you know, to that time. So we ended up getting horses, or that one horse, and we never really rode it or anything. It was kind of mean. And then we had ducks and chickens, and the ducks would roam the yard, and we would randomly find like duck nests with tons of eggs in them. And you can eat duck eggs just the same as you can eat chicken eggs. And they taste really good too. Um, and chickens are mean too. <laughs> but anyways, our dog... <laughs> this is rated R, so... <laughs> Just hey, <laughs> we never said our podcast was meant for anybody. It's other not than meant for adults. children, so Kappa don't come for me. <laughs> <laughs> that should be a hashtag. Kappa, Kappa don't, don't come, come for me. For me. 